broker than broke down. It's all up in smoke. I've got zero. Gambled and beat no shoes on my feet. I ain't no hero. My luck is on the lost at a horrible cost, and I'm down. Held the ground and viewed as unsound. And I gotta say, I'm the happiest man in the world. She had given her life a new interpretation by ringing the bell for the salvation of souls. And when they hear the bell toll, they know they are on receipt of a place to eat and a place to warm their feet. I said, look at my friend Sheena. Ain't she an angel? Righteously sweet. Her life could have been for naught. Her resurrection was hard fought. And here comes Bobby. He's off the pipe. He should have been dead. We all thought he was up to his neck. He was a wreck, but he kept it in check with a sense of humor. He had us laughing at his antics, even through a tumor. And I hope he hangs on to his health, because roaring at his glorious stories adds to my wealth. And there's Jennifer. She's working, clerking. She's also on the pole, got the young boys jerking. This is no judgment berserk, but homelessness was lurking. She's got a special needs child, so she does it all with a smile. Bordering on, smirking. You know, I think it's safe to say that I had an epiphany that day. Look at all my friends, barely employed, maintaining their integrity, not null and void, inspirational, conversational. These are the things that I've enjoyed. I've seen beggars with the stature of kings. I've seen homeless sharing as if they had wings. And other things, like patients on death's door, smiling more, not knowing what's in store. I saw with clarity, charity, and a humbled me galore. And I went back to that ATM again, and I requested an encore, because sometimes you gotta open up your eyes and see what life is truly for. And that ATM didn't glow. I said, oh, you ain't really broke. You're rich as a king. You just ain't got no money, that's the thing. <laughs> Thank you. 